we have some friends to talk about a new law that was passed in Queen Anne's County. The commissioners just passed a new county ordinance, 1807, stating that you cannot have these lovely pets outside if the weather is 90 degrees or if it's below 32 degrees for longer than 30 minutes. We want to make sure that we're taking care of these pets. So if they're out there for longer than 30 minutes, you could be fined $1,000. So watch the weather, know what the weather is outside, and also keep an eye out for national emergencies if they are announced by the Queens County Department of Emergency emergency services or by the National Weather Service. And we also want to let you know there are ways to take care of our pets. Yep. So yep. we have Amber from the AWL who's going to help us take care of lovely pets like Macon here. Yeah. So what are some tips that we can take care of our pets this summer with? So just like with people, the easiest way to beat the heat or the most uh, effective way is to drink a lot of water. So maybe putting out a second bowl of water is a good idea. Um, just like people, we love to go swimming when it's hot. And so maybe a kiddie pool, and you can get those at the, the Dollar General pretty cheap, but a kiddie pool is a lot of fun. Just make sure you're dumping it out and putting new water in it every day. Mm -hmm. uh, and dump it out at night because you don't want that mosquito population building in your backyard, right? right. Um, and then another one that's, uh, that's interesting is most people like to do the, the summer cuts, the summer shaves. Right. But that's actually as... As counterintuitive as it might be, you should not shave your animal for the summer heat um, because they're already going to blow that down coat, which is what insulates them during the winter. And that top coat, once that's all that's left, will reflect the heat and insulate them from the heat. Oh, interesting. So instead of going to your groomer and asking for a summer shave, go to your groomer and ask for a de-shed. So do a really big de-shed at the beginning of the summer and then just maintain throughout the summer. Oh man, maybe I should ask for that next time. Yeah, right? Okay. Get, a, get a little bit of weight out of there. And then, of course, the flea and tick population is out of control this summer, so make sure that you are staying up to date with your um, heartworm flea and tick preventative every month. Okay. So those are great tips that anyone can use on all their pets to stay up to date this summer, yeah. keep your pets safe. That's right. And if anyone has any questions, they can give you guys a call, right? Absolutely. We are. We pride ourselves in being a resource for the community. So any questions at all whatsoever, we would love to field them for you. Right. And we always care about all of our animal safety. So if you have any concerns or if you ever think an animal's in trouble, please give Animal Control a call and they will help you and any animal that might be in danger.